Amy Love here and I'm here with another little project and we are going to create this sweet little glittery sequins mix. So adorable. So um, I get out my little cup and my special little spoon and I decide you know what color a mix I want to make and of course I'm going to make a pink one because that's what I do. So I gathered all my pink things and I'm just spooning bits in here and there. And I love to make these glittery sequin mixes because they're beautiful and sparkly. And I love to send them out in happy mails um, and with swaps. I just think it's a fun gift and I, I love to receive them. So I love to gift them too. So I wanted to add these stars and I was trying to show you. Of course, my camera wouldn't focus. So I feel like you can see them better when I drop them into the cup. They're so cute. Teeny tiny little stars. So I'm trying to add some lighter colors now to kind of lighten it up because it was a rather dark pink mix. So those are like little white uh, flowers with an iridescent finish on them. They're so cute. And I'm going to add a little bit of white. Oh, it's already so beautiful. So now it is time to add the little glitter mixes. It's the um, nail art uh, glitter sequins that I got from bbcraft.com. And I have a link to them below. You, It comes in 12 different colors. And I'm going to use two of the colors in here. And it's like just beautiful sparkle. Just gorgeous. Perfect for one of these. I'm making one of these sequins mixes. So cute. So that one was a little more pink, and I believe this next one's a little more um, white and silver. So sparkly. Just look at that. Oh my gosh, how fun. And now I am also going to add some of the cubic zirconia stones. These stones come in three different sizes and in clear and pink in this cute little box. And I am going to try to put in mostly small and medium, and I think I ended up putting um, one large one in here. And you will find a direct link to those um, in the description box as well. They're just so cute. And this is so easy to do. And then packaging it up, this is just an adorable way to package it up. So. I am going to be using the uh, one of the glass jar bottles with a cork stopper that I got at bbcraft.com and I will put the link below to that and I'm actually going to use the smallest one uh, that came in the set. So there are two, uh, you know, like a large, a medium, and a small and I'm going to use the small to package up my little sequin mix, sequin glitter sparkle mix. Look at how pretty it is. Oh, it's so cute. So, so cute. So here is the little, aren't these adorable, these little dome bottles. I love them. So I am going to fill this up with the sparkle mix. And um, then we will just a little bit decorate the outside of the bottle. But I mean, it just doesn't need too much decorations because it's already adorable and sparkly. And of course, you will find the link to BB Craft below, plus a direct link to all of the items I'm using that you can find at their website. It will be in the description box. Look at how cute! So sweet. And since you get 12 different colors of this uh, little nail art glitter, you can just make all kinds of mixes with this. It's so cute. So I decided I would put a little bit of washi tape around the bottom of the tube, but I'm not putting it over the cork. It doesn't need to be um, fastened on. The cork fits in there really snugly, so it's not going to come out until somebody pulls it out. But I just wanted to put a little bit of washi tape around the bottom of the tube so that I could attach an adorable little bow. Give the bow something to, I mean, yeah, give the bow something I could uh, glue it down to. So it's super cute, and what a cute way to gift out a sequin mix. So I hope you enjoy my little tutorial, and please leave me a comment and let me know what you think, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye, everyone.